five new restaurants just opened in Bentonville, Arkansas, and we need to talk about every single one of them. Yes, we do. So, let's talk about that. Hey, everybody. If you don't know who I am, my name is Philip Shepard. I'm a local real estate agent located right here in Northeast Arkansas. I actually was a real estate broker in Chicago for over a decade in the dumpster fire state known as Illinois, with an S. And I could have chosen to move anywhere I wanted to in America, but I chose right here in Northwest Arkansas for so many different reasons. It is by far the best place to live in America, by far. So call me, email me, text me, let me know when you're coming to the area to check out the whole area. We can talk about all the reasons why I chose Northwest Arkansas versus anywhere else in America. And if you haven't been down to Northwest Arkansas quite yet, I made something called the NWA Starter Pack. Sounds exactly what, what it is, literally a starter pack full of all the cool things north of Arkansas. What's going on in downtown Bentonville? What's going on in Fayetteville? What are the schools like? What are the hospitals like? All the things you need to know about north of Arkansas, boop, 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 package, ship right to your home, right to your home, literally goes right to your home. Enter your name below, enter your address below, where am I shipping this package to? Let me know in all the information below, I'll make sure to get the package shipped to you right away. Also, side note, it does come with your first free mountain bike, so... That's pretty cool. And, 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 I know what you're thinking. I know what you're thinking. It is my favorite four-letter F word. Free! So enter your information below and make sure they get the package shipped to you right away. And the first restaurant that just opened up in Bentonville, Arkansas is actually Ozark Mountain Bagel. And you're thinking, Philip, uh, excuse me, uh, you talk about them all the time. What's going on there? And that is correct, sir or ma'am. Ozark Mountain Bagel just opened a, another location on the south end of Bentonville. And so their bagel glory their bagel supremeness has entered into the outskirts of Benville, so I am very excited for that. Obviously, they have their Johnson stuff going on in there. They have, now they have the new Benville location, so super jazzed. Anyways, when you're on in the south end of Benville, definitely check out Ozark Bagel if you are not fully aware of what they do. The lost art of actually making bagels is it like again lost art. So they make their own bagels, they cook their own bagels. Actually, they make they actually transferred their bagel making process from the downtown uh, Bentonville over to this new location, so yay. So if you want, obviously, the freshest of fresh bagels come off the platter into your lips, into your mouth, definitely check out the south end of the Bentonville one. If you want your New York style, you want your everything bagel, you want it on the whole thing, the whole thing, so good. Anyways, I'm getting hungry. I gotta stop talking about this. Anyways, Ozark Mountain Bagel, south end Bentonville, I'll see you there. And the second restaurant we need to talk about that just opened up in Bentonville, Arkansas is actually called The Botanical. Technically not a restaurant, has little server food stuff, but it's actually a bar. And you're thinking like, wow, it's a different bar. But that's the thing about Bentonville specifically is there's not a lot of bars that stay open later and this one does. So that is the fun thing with Bentonville is that it is definitely a sleepy town after the time of like 9 p.m. It just kind of whoop. So seeing a little bit more nightlife, so to speak, is a good thing. So the Botanical just opened up. I've had a lot of friends go there. They say it's very top tier good. They had good experiences, love it. I'm sure I'll do a review at some point. But anyways, if you're in downtown Benville, near that whole downtown section area, definitely check out the check out the Botanical. I'm sure it'll be fantastic and good. And if you are more of a late night owl, past 11 p.m. Uh, midnight time, definitely check out them. They'll be well open and ready to serve you. And uh, going from, let's say, Crystal Bridges or maybe some of the Walton Arts Center down in Fayetteville, heading up and kind of coming back to Benville, definitely stop at the Botanical. But before I jump on to the next point, I have something brand new called Instant Home Updates. So maybe you're looking to move to the area and using things like Realtor.com, Zilla.com, or Redfin, way too slow. Notifications, way too slow. That's why I made something called Instant Home Updates. Sounds exactly like what it is, like Instant Home Updates. So let me know with all the information below. I'll make sure you don't miss a single notification when it comes for homes for sale or for rent, all in North Arkansas. Also, side note, every single Friday, I send an email I just kind of talk about all the cool things North of Arkansas. What's going on in downtown Benville? What's going on in Fayetteville? When is first Thursdays? When is first Fridays? What's going on at the amphitheater? What new businesses are moving here? What's going on over at Pinnacle? So much, so much going on all the time. Enter your name below, enter your email below. I'll make sure you get that email every single Friday, just kind of keeping you updated with all the cool things happening in the area. But, huh, sadly, you will get a little fear of missing out, a little FOMO, so to speak. But I promise you will be the most informed person eventually when you make your way down to North Arkansas. And the third restaurant we need to talk about opening up in Benville, Arkansas is a little bit mysterious, but I have some some tea for you, so to speak. I'm gonna spill the tea for you. I don't actually know where this is gonna be located. I couldn't find inf information. I have this like Google search that literally scours the internet for 
things of Northeast Arkansas, and this actually popped up. So I don't know how, how public it is, but there's a website, so I'm not too crazy. But a new restaurant called Danger Dave's is opening up in Bentonville. I don't know the exact location yet, but long story short, the reason it's kind of exciting for me is that Prelude Breakfast Bar is the mastermind behind this. And if you've been to Prelude in Fayetteville, dang. So uh, Prelude in Fayetteville, if you are unaware, probably the best breakfast in Fayetteville and probably a good portion of the United States. If you haven't been there, you might want to check it out. Just an option. But Prelude, the geniuses behind Prelude are moving up to Bentonville, open up Danger Dave's, so I'm looking forward to that. I'm sure there's gonna be a lot of mirrored copycat stuff, in, which I'm totally fine with because I love it. But I think they're gonna lean, lean a little bit away from the breakfast side and do more of like the lunch dinner side. So if they go that dire direction, I am gonna be there day one. I'll be sleeping outside, I promise you that. Anyways, Danger Dave's opening up in Fayetteville, or excuse me, in Bentonville, and I'll be exciting to see a new prelude style thing over in Bentonville. So I'm, I'm jazzed. I'm also hungry. And the fourth restaurant that just opened up in Bentonville, Arkansas is actually Baking in Wonderland. Obviously the theme of Alice in Wonderland, the whole thing. But anyways, new bakery opened up in Bentonville, already, already opened. Cakes galore, pastries galore, cinnamon rolls galore, anything that's delicious with a decent amount of carbs, and sugar and cinnamon and frosting galore, that's your place. Anyways, new bakery opened up in uh, Benville. Obviously they kind of more lean towards the cake side of things like wedding cakes, specialized cakes of that nature, but definitely check them out if you are needing that, like the goodness of sugar, so to speak. But anyways, long story short, definitely check them out when you're in, in Benville, stop in grab a couple things, hit the road and maybe grab a, <laughs> a cake too. I'm here to grab a, a, a custom cake right now, pick up and go. Anyways, uh, definitely check them out if you're around Benville. And the fifth and final place we need to talk about when it comes to opening up in Bentonville, Arkansas. And you're gonna be like, Philip, you're a liar, because I'm about to tell you a restaurant that is not in Bentonville. You're like, this whole video's a this whole video's a lie. Not true. Back off. Okay, the next place we need to talk about is actually tacos and tamales. Not opening up in Bentonville. They actually just opened up their location in South Fayetteville. So the reason I mention that is because if you love your tacos and tamales, the whole the whole kit and caboodle, which I'm a big fan of. They just opened up their location, and this is more of a PSA, public service announcement, let's call it that. Tacos and Tamales just opened up their South, their South Fayetteville location next to Central Barbecue on the south end of Fayetteville next to the Grazerback Greenway. A whole farmer co-op going on downtown, uh, excuse me, on the south end of uh, Fayetteville next to the new university section. A whole thing. You got to check it out. Tacos and Tamales, big fan. Love the Benville side. Going to love this, the Fayetteville side. Probably going to spend too much time and too much money and, too, and eat too much food in either one of them. But long story short, if you're in Fayetteville and you want to sample again the deliciousness of tacos and tamales, definitely check them out in South Fayetteville. All right, that's all I have for you guys today. Again, if you are thinking about coming down to Northeast Arkansas, download my three day itineraries link below. Maybe you're an adventurer, maybe you're a sports person, maybe you're a foodie, maybe you're a sightseer, maybe you have kids, whatever it is. There's a three day itinerary link down below for you. So go ahead and download it and use it when you get down here. Also, when you do come down here, I can give you the $10 tour so I can kind of show you around the whole area. Plus, we, we could check out some homes for sale or for rent and see how far your dollar would go in North Arkansas compared to where you're coming from. All right, guys, I'll see you next one.